So uh, occasionally I'll do tutorial videos. I'll do how-to videos. I got a few. Uh, the video where I showed people how to stop cats from chewing on wires, that's that's actually gotten, I think, close to 19,000 views at the moment. I'll put that in a card up on the screen right about now if you want to check that out. But I thought it was about time I did another how-to video. And this time we're on my desktop. Well... Normally I do a uh, 2560 by 1080 ultra wide, but we're, we're, we're down to 16 by 9 for the video. But what I wanted to show you in this video was how to use a program called Revo Uninstaller to uninstall programs. And I know what you're probably thinking. You're thinking, oh, it's it's some stupid uninstaller. It's some third-party bullcrap. It's going to you know, correct my computer. It's a piece of crap. It's not going to work. I promise this is good. I wouldn't be making this video if I thought this was bad. So just, just trust me on this one. Watch the video. Give it a try for yourself. There's going to be a link in the description of the video where you can go and you can download this and try it for yourself. So here's what we're going to do. First, we're going to open up Revo Uninstaller. So there's my start menu here. So let's, uh, where's Revo? There it's right there. Revo Uninstaller. So we're going to click that. Hit yes. Okay, so we're, you're going to give it a little bit to find all of the stuff installed. It might take a little bit longer for you. Because I do have this installed on an M2 drive, but but uh, yeah, it, it 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 never takes more than 10 or 15 seconds usually. So this is where we're going to pick a program to uninstall. So I'm going to uninstall the Aura software, which has been crashing like crazy and it's stupid and I hate it. So we're going to click on that. I'm going to right click on that. I'm going to hit uninstall. So it's going to create a system restore point for you. So that's fine. So if so if, if if the unlikely happens and you do end up deleting something here that you needed or, or something that was starts causing you problems, which has never happened for me, but if it does happen, you can uh, use System Restore. So what this will do is this will run this, the program's default uninstaller, the same thing you would do if you went into the control panel and uninstalled it or if you told the program to uninstall. So we're going to bring that up. This is just the standard uninstaller. So we're going to click OK. It's going to uninstall. And it says, okay, you, you're uninstalled now. Right. So that's where this would normally end. That's where you would normally uninstall a program and you would go about your business. But here's the thing with Revo Uninstaller. Now what we're going to do is we're going to look for crap that gets left over. That's what Revo Uninstaller does. So you can select one of three scanning modes. You can do safe, moderate, or advanced. Now if you're paranoid about this and you're worried that you're going to you're gonna delete something vital, you're going to screw something up, you can click, you can click safe or moderate, but I'm going to click advanced here. I always use advanced. So I'm going to click advanced, and whichever one of these you click, we're going to hit scan. Now it's going to look for things that the default uninstaller left behind that, that the program was using or that were part of the program. And let's let's see if it finds something. This might take a little bit. Okay, so here's, so first it will show us the uh, leftover registry keys in your registry, if it found any, and it did find some. So what we want to do is, you just want to look and you want to make sure these are related to the program that you just uninstalled. It was, it was the ASUS Aura program. So see, we know this one's fine right here, ASUS Aura. See, we know these are fine. This is ASUS Aura. These are fine. So I'm just going to hit Select All. You can select individual ones if you like, but I'm going to hit Select All. And then I'm going to go down here and I'm going to hit Delete. And it's going to say, are you sure you want to do that? And I'm going to click Yes. Okay. So now that we've done that, now it's showing us what files or or folders that were left over. See, this is stuff that the default uninstaller didn't uninstall. If you didn't use Revo, this will just sit on your system forever until you reformat it. So we're going to look at these, and we're sometimes it's a lot, but it's just a couple now. It's a folder and it's one file. So we're going to make sure that these are related to the program that we're uninstalling. It says ASUS Aura, ASUS Aura, yeah. So we can select individual ones if we like. But I'm just going to hit Select All. I'm going to hit Delete. And it's going to say, are you sure? And we're going to hit Yes. It's going to remove those. See, it says Selected, but remaining files will be deleted during the next system restart. So those might be files that were loaded, like a, something that was already running. So, it will, so the next time we restart the computer, those will be deleted. They can't be deleted right now because they're in use. And then once we're done with that, we click Finish. And that's it. So as you see, that's, I mean, get this program. Like I said, there's going to be a link in the description below. I want you to get it, 
try it, uninstall something using the message I just showed you, and see if you see if you're not hooked. Because once you see the crap that some of these programs and games and stuff leave behind in your system that just sits there forever, yeah, I, th I think I think you'll be convinced. That's what convinced me. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you found that useful. If you did, share this with somebody and give me a like if you liked it. And uh, yeah, until next time, have a good day, everybody.